Uh, so this next couple of exercises that I'm going to demonstrate uh, uh, are core exercises, particularly aimed at working the uh, the internal abdominal muscles, the, uh, the pelvic floor and the transverse abdominis in particular. So we we'll start off on our backs in a neutral spine position. So you may have to tilt the pelvis to find that neutral spine. So we don't want it to be completely flat through here. You should be able to just get the tips of your fingers under your spine. If you can get beyond the second knuckle or more under your back, then you've tilted the pelvis too much. You've got too much of a curvature through the lumbar spine. So we just want to find that comfortable neutral point fingertips just under the spine then we engage the deep abdominal muscles so then carefully keeping that engagement through the abdominal keeping the spine in neutral you bring your legs up into uh, into a, what we call tabletop position here and then your first one is called leg reaches so you just exhale and extend the leg out try not to allow the uh, the pelvis to tilt as you do that so you're maintaining that engagement through here now your target is to be able to get as far extended through the leg as you can without the spine lifting and without the abdomen distending. If you can feel your abdominal muscles pushing against your fingertips as you do this rather than pulling away from your fingertips, then you're engaging your rectus abdominis, which is the, uh, the six pack abdominals and not those internal muscles. Another thing to concentrate on while we're doing this is Keeping a neutral neck position, so the back of the neck lengthen, chin in, shoulder blades down, palms up to get external rotation through the shoulders, rather than shrugging the shoulders and extending the neck. Okay, so that is the leg reaches, and then we can move on to dead bug. So we pr bring the arms in now, and this brings in an element of uh, coordination as well. So with this one, it's opposite arm to opposite leg. Exhale, exhale as you extend, inhale as you come back. Again, keeping that neutral spine and keeping that core engaged. And again, if you can get the leg all the way down to the floor and the back of the hand all the way down to the floor without that spine lifting and without that tummy distending, then you're doing really well. So that is two really basic core exercises that are actually a hell of a lot tougher than they look that will really help to improve core strength, core engagement, and your posture as well. Okay.